Welcome to Swift Lane Online Training. My name is Victoria and I am your Customer Success Manager here at Swift Lane. Today we're going to go over Activity Feed menu item. This video series is part of the Admin Dashboard Overview. Let's hop right in. All right, as you can see, we are on the Activity Feed page and you can see the last activity with the photo of the reader view as well as the user's uploaded photo via the Swift Lane app. You can also add a note to an activity. We could say picking up hardware, save, and that note will be saved for future reference. You can also see the timestamp at which the reader captured the picture. You can filter the reporting here by user access, access point, site, access type, and you can also filter by a start date and end date. So let's filter by user, let's filter by myself. And as you can see, the activity feed shows all of my access activity here. Now you can filter by access, and this is by granted, can also see all the denies and you can filter by access point. So if you have multiple access points, you can see all the activity. You can see all the activity that are at that particular access point. You can also do a site filter, especially when you have multiple sites. And as you can see, the sites that we've selected here and all the activity is noted below. Access type is another filter. So you can look at all the remote unlocks, possible mobile plus base access. You can look at mobile only, face only. And let's say you need to do a reporting based on a start date and time. You can set those times here and it will change the activity feed here. And that concludes the activity feed page. Thank you for joining and see you on the next video.